Hopefully this will turn out here so you guys can see it. Complaint is charging or battery going dead. So first you take a reading at the battery vehicle running. 13.3, that's not too bad. Obviously it could be a little bit better. Then you leave the uh, negative on the battery and you go to the battery post. Battery post 13.4. So there's a point one volt difference between here and here. And again, that's not too bad either. Should be uh, a little bit higher. Uh, then what you want to do is you do your voltage drop test. You go from battery positive to alternator stud. So there's point one. That's not too bad. Then you do the same thing on the negative from a negative to alternator case. Aha, uh -huh, look at that, 1.2 volts. So then you go from the battery clamp, there's the battery ground on the transmission. You just touch that, you got point 0.1 right here. We go to the stud, point 0.1, and we go to the transmission case, 1.1. So you can see there's a bad connection where this stud connects to the transmission. So we're going to, and you can see here probably as well, if I go to the engine block, there's a one volt difference. So if I check, if I go from battery positive to engine block ground, you can see it's actually charging 14.5 volts, but only 13.5 3 to 13.5 is getting to the battery so voltage drop testing saves your battery uh, or charging system alternator was replaced last year by myself that's my marking <coughs> obviously had this been the issue last year already I would have found it back then already so this is just a, re um, a new development. Over time, this thing becomes uh, is where the resistance is. So we're just going to run a new cable from here to the block, and that should clean things up. I might get you a shot afterwards. Okay. So as you can see, I cleaned the bracket, made sure everything is tight, cleaned the um, the eyelid here for the main ground cable, and I added another ground cable to a stud right here. I removed the uh, original bolt and I put a bolt on that has a small stud on it so I was able to attach the cable. Charging voltage now at the battery is Voltage drop on the positive is 0.1. Voltage drop on the negative to the head is 0.2, so that's fine. 14.4 at the battery, perfect. And 14.5 at the alternator. 14.4 at the battery.